Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Assalamu alaikum my name is Asan and today we are going to set up custom domain for web and email in Beehive before starting work it's my request please subscribe my channel thank you now back to our work so we are in Beehive dashboard on left side you see settings so click on it so we are in setting on left side you see publication so click on it and then in publication you see multiple option so click on domain so we are going to add domain and verify now you see verify domains and then you see add custom domain so click on it then you see new custom domain so you can add your domain here so we are going to add domain so this is our domain and then you see add domain button so click on it now domain is added then you see domain added and verifying so we are going to add txt record so click on it and then you see verify so again click on it and then you see create a dns record for your domain type name value so we are going to add it in dns section in domain and then click on verify now go to hosting and this is our domains and then you see setting button so click on it now domain setting open and we are going to add dns record for txt and then verify domain now domain setting open and scroll down we are going to add txt record and then you see advanced tool so click on it and then you see manage advanced dns record so again click on it so click on continue now manage advanced dns record section open so we are going to add txt record then you see button add record so click on it now pop up open and then you see add advanced dns record and then you see drop down type select txt record and then you see refer to now select other host and then you see host name txt value so we are going to add host name now paste so we added beehive authentication now go to beehive and then you see name we added and then you see value now copy this go to hosting again so add here txt value now paste and then you see ttl so you can select according to your requirement and then click on add now you see message success advanced dns record updated please allow up to 24 hours for changes to take effect so we added txt record and now we are going to verify domain go to beehive again and then you see verify so click on it now verifying and then you see button verify so click on it now you see message domain has been verified and then you see verified done and we waited few minutes and then click on verify so our verified domain done so we are going to add more domain so click on add custom domain and then add domain and then click on add domain again adding now you see domain successfully added verified again click on add custom domain so add domain mail.com then again click on add domain domain successfully added now you see domain verified so after adding txt record in domain dns we waited few minutes and then we click on verify and then you see our domain is verified so you can add domains according to your requirement so we added three then scroll down you see web domain so we are going to select custom web domain now and we are going to select custom web domain and then you see website url so click on select custom web domain and then you see web custom domain drop down select so this domain www and then click on configure domain now you see verify domain configuration type c name and then you see name and value so we are going to add it in hosting now go to hosting and then you see add record so click on it select c name then you see refer to www now add value 
so when we try to add cname record with www then show message a record already exists for www please remove the a record so we are going to remove a record with www first and then add cname record now cancel so this is our www record for a now delete it so click on delete now you see success advanced dns record updated so we deleted a record so refresh the page again so now a record deleted so click on add record and then select c name value of www then paste value and then select ttl and then click on add now you see c name record is added so after that we are going to verify domain in behave first we delete our a record and then we added c name record now go to behave account again and verify setup so click on it custom domain can only be checked every 10 minute so wait and click on verify setup button now you see custom domain configuration verified now close this now you see web domain live so web domain verification done and then we are going to add email domain now select so you can select custom domain select this and then click on configure domain then you see pop up with verified domain configuration so you can add type cname record in your dns and you see three cname record so we are going to add it now you see type name value now copy name go to hosting and then add record select cname and then you see refer to select other host so add name now go to hosting copy value back to account now paste and then select ttl and then click on add so click on it now you see message success advanced dns record updated so we are going to add other two cname record also so we added three cname record now we are in cname section and refresh the page so we are in cname record and you see all three c name record we added now go to behave and then you see verify setup so click on it then you see custom domain configuration verified now close and then you see email domain so we are going to update email so click on it so we are going to add support and then click on confirm so this is our new email now you see saved and live and then you see redirect domain so click on it now you see select custom domain select domain and then click on configure domain and now you see a domain so you can add this a domain in your hosting now go to hosting again and then you see add record so click on it so we are going to add a record and then you see refer to at the rate and then we are going to add value and then ttl 1 hour so click on add now you see success advanced dns record updated so now we are going to wait again now refresh the page again so we added a record from behave now you see but we have to a record with the name at the rate so we are going to delete it now click on it so click on delete now record deleted now refresh the page now you see other a record deleted so we have only this a record with at the rate name from behave now go to behave account and then you see verify domain configuration so click on verify setup now you see custom configuration done for this domain now close and then you see redirect domain live email domain live scroll up you see web domain and then you see verified domain on top you see notification your email sending domain does not have the correct dmarc verification please check out the dmarc authentication guide to ensure your domain has the proper dmarc setup now open this link now you see how to set up dmarc authentication scroll down then you see user 
DMARC wizard to create your DMARC record. What is custom domain that you will be using to send email via BI? So you can add your domain. So we added our domain and then click on next button and then you see define how stick you want your DMARC policy to be non quarantine reject. Then you can select option according to your requirement. You see three option non quarantine reject and then click on next. So you can add your email. So we added this email. So you can add email according to your requirement and then finish record. Now you see your DMARC record record type txt so you can add this txt record in your hosting go to hosting and then you see add record so click on it now pop up open and then select txt record refer to other host now host name underscore dmarc so we added target value underscore dmarc now add txt value and then select ttl and then click on add now dns record added now go to beive again now scroll up, refresh the page, now go to record again, your new record will be published. But please note that the time is take for each DNS provider to fully process may vary. DNS propagation for DMARC policy can take anywhere from 10 seconds to 24 hours. Now refresh the page again and after few time you see our issue is fixed, DMARC notification gone and on top you don't see any notification now and now we are in beehive dashboard and then you see landing page link newsletter page link now open it so after few hours our website link is working fine so propagation time period end so i hope you like this video please like comment share subscribe thank you for watching